What's going on, guys? It's Mike, here to talk to you about Jaden Daniels, the LSU quarterback. We're going to talk a little bit about what he brings to the NFL, his game-breaking speed, what's going to be for fantasy football. Let's get into the film. All right, let's start at the beginning of the season. So, everyone loves Jaden's rushing ability, but we got to talk about this. Brother, slide. Please. Please, look at this. Nice. Big play. Just go down there. There's no need for it. It's first and ten. Let's talk a little bit about the zip. So, Daniels has the arm strength to make it happen the next level. It's not like he's Allen or Mahomes. But I identified the blitzer here. Throws a deep out to the college field side, which is actually further than pro because of the way they set the hashes up. And puts this on a rope. Woo! Look at that zip. Sometimes he trusts his receivers and his pre-snap reads a little too much. Corner shows that they're drifting to the outside pre-snap until he doesn't post-snap. The corner ends up jumping this route. Daniels never sees him. It's an easy pick. Happened a couple of times on film, but with only four picks on the season, can't knock him for it too much. I think Daniels likes being blitzed. All right, so here he identifies it early. He's going to fade back a little bit, and he's going to hit neighbors on a nice little crossing route. Let's just let's watch this from another angle. So he enjoys it. He's looking left the whole time. He doesn't freak out. He doesn't even look at neighbors pre-snap. All he does, snaps the ball, puts in the bread basket. So you can't blitz him, but you also can't run man against him. So he identifies that all the defenders have their heads turned. They're locked on the receivers here. He sees a gap and just takes off. This is fourth and four. He turns it into first and goal. You love that from your quarterback. It's another angle here. You can see he identifies the corner on the far right, chasing his man, loses contain, and he just takes off. That is an easy, easy big play for a big time player. Going back to that trust, he throws a beautiful, beautiful fade route. Uh, he's about 10 to 15 of these on film, but I just wanted to give a quick shout out to Brian Thomas. Uh, we'll probably do a film study on him later because he rocks 6'4", junior. But just can't put it in a better place about his ball placement so here he is rolling right neighbors is coming left he hits him perfectly in stride so he's able to catch the ball get upfield to make defenders miss perfect hey guys if you like the content be sure to like and subscribe it's just a click for you but it means a lot for us so appreciate it let's get back into it all right now that's out of the way Let's talk a little bit about his ball placement at the end of the year. So he he is a finished product as far as passing goes. Here you're gonna see Lacey run a pretty deep in route. And instead of leading him into the defender here, he just chooses to lead him a little bit outside. Most of the time you talk about a quarterback throwing it outside on an in route, it's a bad thing. That was perfect. Now we're gonna talk a little bit about what he brings specifically as a rusher. Everyone's covered. This should be the end of the play. First 15, most quarterbacks would throw this ball away, live to see another down. Instead, this starts the second play for Jaden Daniels. Every play always has this option and it always has this outcome available. These are Alabama defenders. These are some of the best defenders in the nation and he makes them look silly. We're just gonna close this out with a highlight video. This is, it's just some of his best runs over the season. There, there were too many to fit in here. I think that he is going to make a very, very solid NFL quarterback and should probably be the number two quarterback off the board in rookie drafts, as long as he gets that top 15 draft capital and the security that comes with it. I'm completely on board with Daniels as a prospect. I'm completely on board with Daniels for fantasy football. And I think this is a high quality player for years to come. Tell me what you think in the comments. Be sure to share it with your friends. And if you liked it, you can find me on Twitter at FFMikeCash. If you didn't like it, my name is Eric Watts.